Hello everybody, my name is Crickster, welcome to Let's Play The Future Of Gaming. Now, I've played this game for a little bit already, but uh, it seems like a pretty decent game. Basically, I got it from Gabe Jolt a few hours ago, and so the game deals with you having to dodge objects in reality and virtual reality. So, uh, yeah, here we go. Level 4, oh, I was gonna start at level 1, but alright. Yeah, there's fans in this level, so... <laughs> Let's try that again. I got hit twice on that fan. There we go. Descent. All right. Oh, there's no oven there this time. Thank goodness. There was an oven at that spot where I just jumped at. Uh. There was an oven where. Every time I jump there, you have to keep going over and over again just to get past the oven because the oven eventually is not there anymore. And I'm pretty sure it's there now. <laughs> Let's hope it's not there. See, now it's there. Whoo! On fire. And again. I think you have to get past the oven in order to, uh... Okay, I was like... <laughs> okay, maybe if I just do a backup thing, it moves the objects too. So, if I back up, and then jump up there. Hey, that worked! Oh yeah! Got past another one! Let's get past level 6. Oh yeah, I remember now. This uh, level here is like the most complicated because there's no possible way to get past this. And the Legos are there. Oh wow, Legos. Wait a minute, I see. You go in there first, and then everything moves a little. Yep. Alright. So we go to the box, and everything moves a little bit more to the le left. Left. <laughs> So let's just back up just a tiny bit and then jump and jump again. See that that has no possible way to get past that. So what if I Legos in midair? Fantastic. Fantastic. You know, I wonder how he actually looks what he's actually playing this in his room. Parents walk in and he's, they're just all like, What are you doing, Timmy? And I'll be all like, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's any possible way, but if you guys want to see more gameplays, um, like and subscribe below, and as always, see ya.